never know what we find in these jobs. Um, that's the good part about junk removal is you come across some good stuff. We got, we got an automatic battery charger, engine starter. Austin here with Crack and Junk Removal. Today we're excited to help out a customer in Kingsport with a garage cleanout. She has all kinds of junk, a little bit of everything, so we're happy to help her out. We're here, so we're gonna get started. But before we begin, let's go ahead and look at the job one more time, show you what this job entails. And then uh, later, we got a call for a commercial customer at the Johnson City Mall to pick up some trash. So we moved this job up. It was actually scheduled for later in the afternoon to this moved it up to about today which is about right now at 11 30 or so so that we can get to that other commercial job later and uh, i had another call for a construction debris removal job but I just can't get to it today so put that one off to tomorrow but enough of that let's go ahead and look at this job real quick one more time here's a quick look at the job so we got all this stuff in the middle we got all this stuff over here and this stuff originally she didn't want gone um, so when we came, she did say she wanted the items on the shelves removed. Non-hazardous waste paint and the chemicals will stay. So we did have to upcharge her for that. And then she wanted the shelves gone too, so there was an additional fee for that because they do take up space. And we got just the junk on top of there. We got all this stuff down here. And... All of this stuff, all the way back to that red suitcase, all this stuff the customer's keeping. So, again, just the stuff up here, stuff down here. We got all that, and then we have all this to remove. You never know what we find in these jobs. Um, that's the good part about junk removal is you come across some good stuff. And this little chemical sprayer might come in handy. Um, nice wheelchair. Too bad I'm not to the point where I need that yet. Actually, that is good. It's not a bad thing. Um, what else do we got in here? We got a little skill saw. And, oh, look at that. Skill saw is brand new. Wow, that's nice. Awesome. We got another, uh, what is this, a buffer? Um, I have no use for a buffer, but we got some golf clubs back there. A little outdoor rug. Uh, we got this compactor too. Uh, I don't know if it works or not. Nice little camping chair. Um, we got this old Black and Decker uh, circular saw. I don't know if it works or not. What else do we got? We got an automatic battery charger, engine starter, a lot of cardboard boxes. We got some, looks like some blinds. More golf clubs. Oh, empty trash can, that helps. Um, little filing cabinet. Little, it's actually a big filing cabinet. Uh, what else do we got in here? We got this old drawer, little beanie. What else do we got? Oh, hello, hello. None of that, we don't want that. Throw that stuff out. Old dirty Playboys. Um, we got some 5W30 motor oil. We got a little bit of everything in this in this cleanup. So yeah, we've been here about 10 minutes already, trying to stack all the boxes. Uh, we're gonna stack the boxes first, get those stacked nice and neat, then throw in all this random trash. So, all right, my helper just arrived. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead and continue on this job because we gotta get to the mall later, help out that commercial customer. So cracking junk removal. Doesn't have time to waste. Got two big jobs today. Excited to help out our customers. So if you need a junk removal pickup and you're in the Tri-Cities, grip cracking junk removal phone call today. 423-430-3921. Having fun, Daniel? Oh, yes. Yeah, fun. You love working for cracking junk removal? Of course. <laughs> Here's a look at everything we got done so far. So we got this middle section all pretty much cleared. You got to get that uh, filing cabinet. We got to get this junk, as you see right here. And then this big heavy trash compactor, it's heavy, put that on the trailer. Here's a look at the box truck. 
Um, probably about, probably about two thirds full. Um, you can see it behind me. We got a little bit of space, so we're doing good, making good progress. Gonna try to take this to the landfill before it rains. So all right, we are all set. Take a look. Box truck is say 80 85 percent full and here's the transformation wow look at this space guys this is amazing it looks so good the customer was very happy very pleased with our service got all the junk cleared out from the middle everything off the wall we took two racks we took a metal filing cabinet loads of cardboard all kinds of waste so now the customer can park her vehicle in the garage she can organize that stuff where she needs to be where it needs to go so overall, yeah, very happy, very pleased uh, to help out our customer. And she had very good things to say about cracking junk removal. So we're all done here going to the landfill.